I just threw $150 out the window. The chart indicates that the Kenda Gauntlet 140-80-18 tire requires the M2 bib mousse. Now, it seems that Kenda has its own unique sizing because that tire could possibly look like a 120-80-18 at first glance. What the Michelin fitment chart recommended, namely the M2, is too large for it. It's impossible for it to fit into this tire. But if I'm seeing correctly, for this size, like the Michelin Enduro 140-80-18, it suggests using an M14 mousse. In other words, this M2 bib mousse is even too big for a standard size 140-80-18 tire. The fitment chart says that this mousse should be at 10 to 13 psi with a Kenda gauntlet. Now, if someone were able to mount this mousse on that tire, which is impossible, it would be at least 50 psi. I couldn't even install this M2 mousse after I punctured it. It simply rolls off the rim because it's too large. Thanks to RockyMountainATV.com for misleading me. The same thing happened with the Techno mousse. It was also so large that no one could mount it. I made this video just to remember and to learn from it. I thought I would try this Kenda tire because it's cheap, but at first glance, I don't like it, as it looks the same as a 120 wide tire, even though it says 140 on it. The Kenda Ibex 110 100 18 is thicker when I compare them side by side. I'll try to buy a Michelin Enduro 140 80 18 tire, hopefully. I can mount this Michelin mousse on it, maybe I won't have to throw it in the trash yet. But it's still frustrating, all of this.